Hello everyone. Welcome to the second video of this YOLO V6 series. In this video, I'm going to show you the installation of this YOLO V6. So before starting the installation, I just want to show you the YOLO V6 GitHub repository. So for that, you have to search in Google uh, YOLO V6. If you search YOLO V6 uh, GitHub, uh, and if you click on the first link, so see, this is the link like maiden slash YOLO V6. So this is the YOLO V6 uh, GitHub repository. And let me tell you, it is not uh, like officially released, okay? So it has been released by this maiden. Uh, it's uh, an organization from China side, I guess. And uh, if you see, it has been uh, launched recently, but uh, people are started actually liking it. And if you see the start and fork request, okay? Uh, so here, uh, introduction wise, uh, I had already given you like YOLO V6 is a single state object detection framework dedicated to the industrial application with hardware friendly efficient design with the higher performance. And we had seen a uh, lots of benchmark okay, between this YOLO model. Yeah, if you see here, this is the graph. And uh, if you see like there are lots of things like uh, they're uh, like you can say bringing up okay in this YOLO V6 like YOLO V, uh, V like YOLO VM okay then large and X model okay like medium large and X model uh, they will be launching soon and also they are planning to make a deployment for this uh, MNN, TNN and NCNN okay and code ML and uh, also they will be including some quantization tools so that uh, you can quantize uh, any of the model okay uh, from this YOLO v6 and uh, here if you see this is the quick in, uh, I mean installation guide okay from here actually you can refer and it is like very easy to install this YOLO v6 okay in our environment and they have given uh, and they have given all the steps okay you can follow and uh, if I talk about YOLO v5 okay uh, if you see like setting up the environment of in this YOLO v6 okay it's like quite easy uh, compared to YOLO v5 okay uh, we have seen our uh, like you can say previous version of the YOLO so here you will observe like it will take just uh, 10 to 15 seconds okay to set up all the environment okay so now let's start it uh, like you can say uh, our uh, installation of this YOLO v6 okay so for that what I'm gonna do I'm gonna open my drive and here I will be uh, taking a notebook like uh, collab notebook you can talk about and also you can uh, install it in your local machine like you can launch your Jupyter notebook there you can also install but uh, for in this course okay I will be showing you inside the collab because collab provides uh, the free GPU okay so that if you don't have GPU in your system so at least you can use collab okay and I will show you the training inside the collab okay using the GPU so here I have taken a notebook let's name it uh, uh, let YOLO v6 okay and here i will be doing the installation but before that i will uh, set my runtime to this gpu so it is non first of all so i will be setting up with the gpu and i just want to see like which gpu i got okay so for that i will be writing a command called nvidia uh hyphen smi okay so if you just write the command and if you execute it so you can see like which gpu you got okay i'm using this free collab uh, but you can also use collab pro uh, but it's fine okay in this case so guys I got Tesla T4 GPU okay it's fine for me now what I'm gonna do I just want to install this uh, yellow v6 okay so for that I will just copy the first command if you see this is the first command and I will just uh, give an explanation mark and this is the command so it will actually clone this repository okay so if you see this is the repository of this yellow v6 first of all you need to clone the repository okay because uh, using this repository we'll be training our model and all okay so now let's run it and if i just expand this folder so if you see it has been cloned okay so if i refresh it uh, so this is the yellow v6 and inside all the files are there okay so whatever you, you can see here uh, it has been already cloned now what you need to do uh, the second guidance is like uh, you need to go to this yellow v5 uh, v6 folder okay i will copy that and uh, here actually i need to go to this uh, inside this yellow v6 okay so if you see this is the yellow v6 folder uh, like now recently I am inside this uh, if I show you uh, here if I do pwd okay I am inside content I guess okay so see slash cons content uh, so by default uh, it consider we content okay and now you need to go inside this yellow v6 so this is the command for that so if I run it now I am inside yellow v6 okay now if I do pwd uh, now you can see I am inside uh, yellow v6 
see I'm inside ELO v6 now what I need to do I need to install this requirement.txt okay so for that uh, I will just copy this command and if you want to see the requirement what are the requirement you have you can expand this okay so now already we have this like in uh, this is the requirement of txt i'll just open that and guys you can see this is the requirement of txt these are the libraries actually you need to run this yellow physics okay uh, and they have also mentioned you need python 3.8 environment okay uh, but in collab okay, it will work fine but whenever you are trying it uh, in your local machine just make sure you have uh, 3.8 python version okay otherwise you can create a virtual environment with the defined of 3.8 python okay that's how actually you can install it now what i'm gonna do i'm gonna just run this uh, command so it will install all the requirements inside my collab see it is uh, downloading this onyx and all so guys uh, it has been successfully installed inside our collab uh, environment uh, so in our next video, I'll be uh, showing you like uh, the custom data set we'll be using for training uh, uh, This object detection model. Okay uh, So yeah, that was uh, all about from this video and uh, now I think uh, you know how to install this yellow v6 and if you see like it took just uh, 10 second to okay uh, like uh, prepare my environment and all uh, So it's like very cool. Okay, so yeah guys. Uh, thank you so much uh, for watching this video and I will see you next time